Hey, welcome back to Pilar. Today we have a Transformers Starstream Coronation action figure from Transformers the movie. The old animated movie, which I didn't like. I know most people are like, oh, it's great. I didn't like it for many reasons. Uh, you can ask me on the Friday Night Podcast if you want to know why. Or you can just ask in the comments and I'll tell you. So this is 86. I don't know what the number means. No idea. Studio Series. I knew it was 22 bucks, so it's usually 50 the box is beat up. Gives me a reason to unbox it. So, let's check it out. Alright, here's Coronation Star Screen. Like I said, the box is pretty beat up here, so we're going to open it up. See how it looks. There's just one piece of tape. Very much like uh, the other Star Scream I have, I it's the War of Cybertron or something like that. That has this cape though. It's a coronation cape here. Do you see? It's a little darker. This is kind of a light purple. All right. I'm sure this crown is probably in there as well. Double check this one. Another throne. This is tie-ins. Sorry, I waste my time doing that. That's pretty cool. I really like that. I like the throne. I think this knife has had better days. Might be time to switch that out. Let's see here. Unleash <clears throat> Star Screamer. Okay. <laughs> this is hand sealed shut. There we go. <laughs> it's free. There we go. Pretty good detail. I know this series of the movie Transformers, I think, got kind of bad reviews. It does feel... That feels like any other Transformer to me, really. And that I've had recently. Of course, they're plastic. Open up this stuff here. Cape has like a bend in it. It's gonna go more over like a you know, cloak, I guess. Alright, so that's there for now. I'm sure this is the crown. Sounds like it's in pieces, that's not good. Oh no, this is his armor mint here. There's the crown. Um, so what this part is? Maybe shin guards. All right, so that's what's in here. Let's check the picture. Um, Maybe it's so a weapons holster, maybe? Okay, let's see here. Get the crown on here. It 
Those are cool. I do like it actually. I'm not gonna transform them because it'll take me forever. <laughs> and these things being so plasticky, I just feel like I might break it. That's not what I want to do. I still don't know. Does this hold his guns, I guess? Oh, it looks like they're shoulder armor, maybe? Let's see. It's not like instructions, right? No, no instructions. Yeah, okay, there's shoulder armor. It's part of his regal gear. On, I think. Maybe. <laughs> all right. That's all his. Well, let's put the cloak on. Here we go. Um, hmm. Hot pick seems to be in the way a little bit. Picture does not help. Unless you have to fold it back, maybe. That's too low, though. Yeah, it's entirely too low. How do you get this out of the way? Hmm. I mean, that's transformed into the jet. I don't think you would put on the size that one wants to do. That's way too low. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, this thing spreads out. So it does go maybe on the side. Okay, that's why it folded. It spreads all the way out. I'll put that back on in a second. So I'm guessing... That still doesn't make any sense, so... It's still too low. Where would you put it? Can't put it down here, right? I guess so. Yeah, it's short enough. <laughs> it looks terrible from the back. All right, pretty decent from the front though. Put that back down, I guess. Here, crown, put the shoulder pads back on. They're gonna fall off instantly. All right. Put these all together. Um, weapons. Of course, you go underneath a shoulder pad. <laughs> Of course. Because that's what it looks like here. Gone this far, right? All right. Snug. Now these, let's put these on wrong. Pointed. Now those must be for the jet. I'm guessing. Anyway.
Hmm. So to go up top like this, not the way I had it. I thought they moved like with the arm, but they don't. So they go up here. Kind of reminds me of bison. Of course, that's another one to cooperate. Alright, it's all together as best I can do without breaking it. There's the throne. <laughs> Maybe because he knows he's going to get broken apart by uh, Galvatron anyway. Well, that's the case, I don't know. Uh, I'll try to put him one more time before we try to sit him down, which is probably going to be a hassle. Keep pushing this arm in is the problem. Alright, it's going to be shoulder pads. No shoulder pads today, Star Screen. Slip that here. All right, cape is in the way. Put that down. So as I'm sitting down, let's see. <laughs> let's kick his legs out as we can. All right, we might be able to do that. Bring his cape on this picture. Let's see, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, I want to see how that'd be impossible. Put it like behind here, maybe. Yeah, that's too big. All right, take the cape off. Arms up a little bit. Now his own wings are in the way. So fold it back, maybe. All right, so here's what he would look like. Sitting on the throne, he would have his shoulder pads on. Better. There we go. I do like this action figure. It looks pretty good. But these plastic, what do you do? Like the plastic on Transformers, they feel so flimsy. Face looks good. I like the detail. Uh, shoulder pads, kind of a pain. I do think they look good on, though. But for 22 bucks, I'm satisfied. He stands well. I like the crown. Uh, the cape. I don't know how I feel about the cape. Put it back on here. Because that looks terrible from the back. So you can't look at that. Put that down here. Actually, after messing with this thing a little bit more, I don't like it. I don't suggest buying the Starscream. I would get something else. Um, these things just keep falling off. I could be doing it wrong, but I messed with it for a while. Couldn't get them on. They fall off constantly. Uh, this cape doesn't look great. So I'm changing my mind on this thing. Detail looks fine. Feels flimsy. As most things do, like I said, uh, the crown and the throne, probably the best part of this set. Cape looks silly from the back, like I said, it's too light. Sword pads, eh. Yeah. 
So I would skip this, actually. But the best thing about this is this box art. Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are.